Coming up next, it's a UFC lightweight division battle. Seems to be a throwback type of matchup here. The classically trained striker taking on the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu black belt. But BJJ black belt with this guy doesn't even begin to describe his It does not describe how good he is. His vast knowledge of all the Jiu Jitsu positions. This guy, once you're on the ground, there is no place where you are safe. You are constantly getting attacked. He's always throwing up submissions, he's always attacking arms. He's always attacking your neck, doing everything to try and make these big submissions coming, even if it's just to change positions to secure top. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. These guys throwing early. there. Not only will this affect his ability to stand. Oh! Oh! Right there, his opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. This dude needs to grab. He needs to wrestle. He has to do something. He cannot take another shot like that. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. And both guys really throwing with authority. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Left-right combo is good. Yeah, he's hurt really bad. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't finish his fight. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Can't take many of those. You better check. Punch coming. It's blocked. Head kick lands. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Big, powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. As effective as straight punches we've seen all night. Huge straight punch lands, and he's got it for a very bad. Round two riding down. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. You ready? You ready? Let's go, guys. Fight. Big leg kick land. Oh, nice kick. Oh, he got him real good, too. And he landed the right hand wow. there. This series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. Oh, hook to the head. He's hurt. He's hurt away. Back. Ferguson gets back up, back into his comfort zone. Punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Well, oh, huge elbow. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Ferguson, I have to say, absorbing those strikes quite well. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Back 
and forth we go. Oh, nice offering there by Oh! Put him to sleep. Back to the feet. An elbow! An elbow! Oh, that one appeared to stun him. Oh, he might be out. And that one was heavy. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a... Wow! He's out! He's done, he's done! Oh my goodness, what a fight. A near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the 